Hello, awesome readers. Today we're going to be reading Explore My World Dolphins by Becky Baines. I am taking all book requests. If you have a favorite book that you would like me to read, please send me your request. My email will be posted in the description below. Splash! Diving into blue ocean waters, a bottlenose dolphin gracefully glides under waves and then leaps high in the air. Dolphins live in family groups. Do you see one, two, three, four? Sometimes there are even more. Living in a group helps dolphins find food and stay safe. Dolphins must watch out for sharp shark teeth, fishing nets, and boats that buzz by. In deep ocean waters, groups of dolphins might get together to form a school. A school can have hundreds of dolphins in it, but in shallow water, you are more likely to see fewer than 12 dolphins together. Did you know that dolphins talk? Instead of words, they make sounds like clicks, squawks, and whistles. Each dolphin has its own whistle, just like you have your own name. A baby dolphin even knows the sound of its mom's call. Dolphins dine on fast fish and slimy squid, crawling crabs, and squirmy shrimp. But it can be hard to see in the dark ocean. How do dolphins find food? A dolphin sees with sound. As it swims along, the dolphin makes a clicking noise. When the noise hits something in the dolphin's path, the sound bounces back. That tells the dolphin the size, shape, and speed of its dinner and right where to find it. What's your favorite food? Watch out for those pinchers. What is this dolphin eating for lunch? Dolphins hunting together swim round and round. They crowd a school of fish into a tight little bunch. Then they take turns swooping in, mouths open for a snack. Dolphin teeth are shaped like upside down ice cream cones. They are great for grabbing. A dolphin's body is made for swimming. They have flippers that help them stop, start, and turn. They have a strong tail that goes up and down, pushing them forward fast. They have a big dorsal fin that keeps them swimming straight. Dolphins are mammals just like you. Mammals are warm-blooded. A dolphin's body stays at a comfy 97 degrees Fahrenheit. Your normal body temperature is a warm 98.6 degrees Fahrenheit. Mammals have backbones. A dolphin's backbone bends so it can move its powerful tail. Do you have a tail? Mammals have hair. Dolphin babies have hair on their noses. Baby mammals drink their mom's milk. Dolphin babies need lots of milk to grow big and strong. What did you eat when you were a baby? Can you touch your backbone? A baby dolphin called a calf is born just under the surface of the water. It is about the same size as a six-year-old boy or girl. An adult dolphin takes a newborn calf up to the surface for a big breath of air. The calf pops out of the water and breathes through a hole in the top of its head. The calf starts to swim right after it is born. Grown-up dolphins have a layer of fat called blubber that keeps them warm, but calves don't. They keep warm by keeping up. 
Lots of mammals move around to stay warm. In days, calves start to talk with the rest of the group. In about six months, calves begin to eat fish. For about three years, a calf stays with its mother. When a dolphin is around six years old, it is all grown up. Being a dolphin isn't all hard work. They enjoy fun and games. Dolphins ride waves. Yippee! They blow bubbles. Boing! They leap high in the air. Wee! When the day is done, you might find dolphins playing games in the moonlight, feasting on fish and squid. Or they might rest for a little while. Good night, dolphin. There are 43 different species or kinds of dolphins. The bottlenose dolphin is the most famous. These mammals live in oceans around the world. Some even live in rivers and lakes. If you ever go dolphin watching, here are a few species you might meet. Believe it or not, an orca, also known as the killer whale, is also a part of the dolphin family. There's also the bottlenose dolphin, the dusky dolphin, the Amazon River dolphin, the spinner dolphin, the rough-toothed dolphin, and the spotted dolphin. The end. Thank you so much for reading with me. If you enjoyed, please don't forget to like and subscribe so that we can read together again.